So perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. They appear to be shaping up in a 4-4-2 formation. Reminders of a, a golden era in English football, I should add, and it continues to hold its place in the modern game. Playing a second striker runs the risk of being outnumbered in midfield, of course, so... With the wider pairing and fullbacks, plenty of running has to be part of their play. And of course, the right service into the box. So it's away we go then. Has he found his man? Cesar tries to locate someone up front. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. And through to the goalkeeper. And it's played forward. Well positioned to make that interception. Cesar. Played in with accuracy. It'll be a throw in. Chip through. Kievo have it back and they can go again. Tries to get it forward quickly. Pinged forward. Drives it towards the front. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Forward it goes. And that has been cleared. Hoists it forward. Oh, he'd have done well to reach that. Well, that's where he wants it. Ball's gone out of play. A great gallop down the right-hand side. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? Nicely controlled. Plenty waiting in the middle. Goes for goal! That was venomous. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Up he gets! Good stop. That wasn't easy. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort.
played it short. Oh, that's meat. Can he deliver? Out to the left it goes. Looks to set one up. That's a case of crossing and hope, and unless they provide some more options, it'll be more missed than hit. Pressure stays on, it is a corner. Tries to get it clear. Balls out on the left now. Couldn't get the direction he needed. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. And it's played forward. Battles to win it back. into a dangerous position. Cuts it out. It's being played forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. There's the whistle for half-time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. And we're off again. Kievo clearly have been the better side for me. Yeah, I know the score doesn't quite reflect it, but if they go about their game in the, in the same manner as the opening 45 minutes, things really should improve. Tries to get it forward quickly. It's a brilliant interception. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Very well to intervene. Plays it out to the wing. Filip Djordjevic pumps it into the area. Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Perugia are making a change now. <laughs> Forward it goes. It's one! Oh, so close to what would have been a memorable goal. And that has to go down as a real opportunity missed. Everything was right until the end. The changes then in quick succession. And it's played forward. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Cleared away, tries to get it forward quickly. And that's sprayed out wide. A really good feat from him.
gets it back. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Just brushed off the ball there. Hoists it forward. And that's been won straight back. Looks to bypass the midfield. Kievo merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Hoists it forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. Tries to get it clear. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. Kievo cannot afford for this to peter out. There just isn't... It's Djordjevic! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Philip Djordjevic is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see... Massive leap! A great save, real class. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Well, the moans and groans from the stands now are very audible. Cesar, up towards the front line. Now it's Djordjevic. He gets past his man. Djordjevic plays it in. So it's going to be another corner. Knocks it away. Oh, good take in a good area. Added time is up. And there goes the whistle. And stalemates. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity.